Hi you guys, so I just wanted to start this video with a quick disclaimer. I know that children's nutrition can be kind of a touchy subject, so I just wanted to throw out that I want nothing more than my child to be happy and healthy and for him to eat the things that are absolutely best for him. But sometimes you don't just have time to sit down and cook a three course meal three times a day just for your toddler. So I try to go with like a healthy, simpler approach. <laughs> His doctor is fully aware of what he eats and she is okay with it. He's very healthy, gaining weight appropriately, very happy. So I just wanted to nip that in the bud before I even get started and just want to let you know that if you have anything negative to say, I won't even read it. It'll just get deleted. Okay, so thank you so much and let's get started. So starting off with breakfast, this particular morning I decided to give him some oatmeal. He really likes the fruit and cream kind of oatmeal and this is a good way that I can sneak in some milk. If you follow along you know that he is not big into milk, he doesn't really like it, so I give him some toddler formula to kind of supplement that and his doctor is aware and she's okay with it. So I just kind of sneak in milk here and there when I can. And with his breakfast, typically I will cut up some fresh fruit. I went with a banana this morning and cut it up into small pieces. Other times I'll give him something like a waffle or some pancakes with maybe some blueberries or strawberries or peaches, just kind of depending on what I feel like making that morning. He doesn't really like eggs. I've tried to give him eggs a few times, a few different ways, and he's not really a big fan, which I'm not really a big fan of eggs either. So I guess I can't really blame him for that. Next, what I do is I just spread the oatmeal on his plate to kind of let it cool a little bit since it's pretty freaking hot whenever it comes out of the microwave. And what I usually do with his food is I'll just kind of spread it across the tray on his high chair because I try to feed him with a plate and sometimes he eats off of it, but most of the time he just gets the plate like suctioned off of the tray and throws it on the floor and I don't like that. <laughs> so here with his breakfast, I just offered him some water in his straw cup. For lunch today, I decided to give him a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. This is one of his favorites. I go between grape and strawberry jelly. For his peanut butter, I like giving him the organic, either peanut butter or almond butter. I don't really care for like a lot of organic food, it really doesn't matter to me. I just like it the best because it's not as thick and it seems to spread a little easier and it makes me feel better that he won't choke on it. So I just put a thin layer of each on the bread and then I smush it down to make it stick together better. And then this is such an awesome hack. I use the pizza cutter to cut the crust off of the bread and to make it into little squares. It's just so much easier to use than a knife. So I definitely recommend this hack if you like to cut the crust off or you know cut anything else because I use it for tortillas whenever I make him like cheesy roll-ups and I also use it to cut his pancakes and waffles and then for the fresh fruit that I give him for lunch I kind of go between just whatever kind of fruit that we have this particular day we had some fresh pineapple that I had cut the day before and he loves pineapple so I just cut it into small little squares so that I was sure that he wouldn't choke on it.
and then I forgot to hold it up to the camera, but these are some little gherkin um, pickles. He likes these, and I do too, so I'll just cut up a couple and give them to him. And for the drink that I offer him for lunch, I usually just give him some juice. He really likes white grape juice and this white grape peach juice. I don't give it to him all throughout the day, just during lunchtime because I wanna give him something different than just water. And he really likes it. Sometimes I have to take the cup away from him because he'll just chug the whole thing of juice and not eat his food. So I do kind of have to take it away sometimes, but I try to give it back whenever he's distracted with his food and not just wanting to chug the juice. After his nap for the day, whenever he wakes up, I'll give him a snack. This day, I decided to give him some blueberries in this little snack cup. He loves blueberries. These are his favorite fruit. Um, sometimes I'll give him like yogurt covered raisins or puffs, maybe some crackers or some fruit snacks, just whatever. I mean, we have a plethora of snacks because we're a snacky kind of family. So I just give him whatever I see first and typically he eats most all of his snack. And here he had a little bit of trouble getting the snack cup open or to get his hand in there. So I kind of had to show him how to do it. He's gotten a little better since he was little, but once I showed him, he got the hang of it pretty well. And I decided to leave this particular clip a little longer because I just think it's so cute whenever he gets his little blueberry out of there and eats it. For dinner tonight, I've decided to get a little bit creative. He usually doesn't eat with us because he eats early, like around five o'clock. But today I decided to get a couple of tortillas and put some Mexican cheese and some shredded boiled chicken on there and kind of smush them together to make kind of like a chicken quesadilla. And then I sprayed a little bit of Pam in the skillet and put the quesadilla in there just to warm it up and make it a little crunchy and make the cheese melt so that the, the tortillas would kind of stick together and not fall apart. Whenever it was done, I got the pizza cutter back out and cut the tortilla or the quesadilla up in some tiny little squares and to be honest I came up with this on the fly and it was actually pretty good so I decided to give him more blueberries just because he loves them so much and for a vegetable I decided to give him some sliced carrots he likes carrots Sometimes he'll eat them, sometimes he won't. It just kind of depends, but I'll also offer him corn. He likes sweet peas. He liked green beans whenever I gave them to him one time, but for the most part, he's not too big on vegetables. He just really likes fruit. Since the little quesadilla was kind of new to him, I've never given it to him before, so he he had to inspect it first to see if he liked it, but he eventually decided that he would eat it. But as he does with every meal, he goes straight for the fruit first. He eats that first thing. And I think this is where, yeah, he tries to eat the quesadilla. And he's not too sure about it at first, but then he ends up eating it.
And there is my dog waiting for him to throw some food on the floor. Well, that is it. This is typically what my toddler eats in a day. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you liked it, give it a big thumbs up and I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.